Hey, what's up guys? Uh, Aaron and Patrick here again with Centropy Chiropractic Training. Wanted to revisit that question that we got from John Dandridge about what happens when the adjustment doesn't go. Um, it is something that happens in practice and we're also, we don't want to be attached to that one and done process, not event. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. And it all kind of starts with how you, um, your mindset when you come into this. Is this, are you trying to fix them in one visit or are you explaining clearly and understanding in your mind that this is a process? Didn't, this problem didn't start overnight. You can't fix it overnight. So it's like with everybody, they need to understand, your patients need to understand that this is a process and that it's a series of adjustments that's gonna create a correction. 100%. And the other thing, if you'll take this into account, you know, the Centropy approach, we're adjusting from a place of ease. And so it's not about getting that cavitation. It's not about getting anything to go. It's about bringing their nervous system into greater ease. And when you're doing this from that dropped in place with no tension, um, it is facilitating their nervous system moving into greater and greater ease. A lot of times, I mean, we're, we have the great fortune of practicing in Europe, and so we get to see a lot of people who've never ever been to a chiropractor before. And what you'll notice is that their nervous system evolves very, very quickly. But a lot of times people have had a lot of kind of grip and rip, do both sides, flying seven, even though it's very, very good and it helps reduce pain, a lot of times their nervous system is under threat. And I know we've discussed this before, we'll go to uh, different chiropractic events and you're adjusting in your office and it's like, ah, oh, everything is just beautiful. And then you go adjust somebody who's been under care for 20 years and it's like adjusting this rubber wall or this kind of latex block. And I know this shows up for me, I don't know about for you, but I immediately think, okay, do I get into my ego and do I make it move so they know that I'm a good adjuster? Or do I go, no. That's what they needed at that moment. Me putting any more force in is not actually moving their system into ease. So if I make it about me and try and get that movement and that crack, it's not actually doing what their nervous system needs. So you let it go, you know that was good for today. Yeah, and if you've stuck around this long for the video to the final, the very end here, one of our good mentors, Ron Overstein, great guy, he, he told us when I was coaching with him, he was my coach, and he said, that's why we got you on a program. So it's like, boom, you adjust them, didn't quite go as you wanted to. It's like, Patrick, that's awesome. Anyway, that's a great adjustment. That's why we got you on a program. Awesome. You know, so um, I hope this helps you guys. This is, it's for us, we've been doing this for a while now and owning that brings freedom to yourself. So we hope you enjoyed it. We'll see you in the next video. See you soon.